Hello, this is Kess Blue, and welcome to more Let's Play Golden Sun, The Lost Age. Last time, we entered this place that we're in, um, which I can't actually show you. The Shrine of the Sea Goddess, where we saved a bunch of rats and we recruited, um, this guy, Breath, the uh, Jupiter Genie, which can restore HP. So this time around, we're going to explore this place a little bit more. Although I'm not sure there's much left to explore, we'll see. And then if there's still time left, we'll go do something else, I guess. Um, okay, well, I obviously can't do anything here, so I suspect I went the wrong way. Because this is where I caught the Ginny, isn't it? Um, that was a fail. Okay then, let's try that again. A little more like it. Uh, yep, this is where it's Ginny. So, wrong way. Whoops. Let's try that again. I actually want to go this way, I suppose? New. No. That is incorrect. Um, well, where else is there to go then, actually? I think the only place that, that was left to go is that one that's blocked off to me. Although, maybe I'm misremembering. It's been a few days since I recorded this last, so... I don't know. I'm sure I'll figure it out soon enough. Um... You know what, though? I am actually feeling pretty sure that I'm done here for now. At least until I have, an a have someone who can freeze some freaking puddles. Oh yes, that'll be nice. Freeze all the puddles. And I definitely get the sense that I'm backtracking in any case, so... Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna teleport out of here, I think. Well, not teleport, really. More like escape. Same difference, I suppose. Um, well, actually, it might be better to walk out. Hmm. Right. Anyway, I'll meet you... At the town? Yeah, that sounds right. Okay, let me get out of town. Bye. And we're here. Now, let's see if these two have anything to say. Oh. You're talking about the pirate again? Those two losers are back home now, eating their snacks. Okay, um, wh where are their homes? I want to pay them a visit. See if I can extort anything out of them. Uh, what are they doing? Are they dancing? Um... I was just practicing for the show we're putting on tonight. Oh, I was just practicing. It's part of our dinner show for guests. You know, because we don't actually have any good f <laughs> Probably shouldn't admit that to me, but... It's funny all the same. But yeah, let's see if we can't track down where those two kids live. I kind of want I legitimately want to see if them or their parents will give me anything for saving them. Because that's what I did. Well, in fairness, I only saved one of them. The other one didn't need saving. Except from his own stupidity. Which, you know, is actually, for a kid that age, is actually fairly calm. Oh, it's Alex! What? What is Alex doing here? Well, well. Our happy little family is back together again. Alex, where did you go? To look for a ship, of course. That's what Creighton said. Oh god, he's talking to... <laughs> Unfortunately, there are none to be had. I spoke to the mayor, and he suggested that we try the large town to the south. Is that where you're going? Yes, Madra may have boats available, and that would be the most logical move. So what do you think? Wait, what do you t- Y-O-U-T? 
Wow, talk. That's a typo. <laughs> no, we should not. Ah, Felix doesn't think it's a good idea. <laughs> no, that's not it. I'm just preoccupied. <laughs> Something like that. Well, that's one way to put it. Quite frankly, I don't think Alex would put up with us. Um, he's sort of above our pay grade, if you catch my meaning. Um, so. Yeah, maybe. Bye, Alex. Hope to see you again this side of never. Actually, no. I take that back. I hope to see you again the other side of never. Um... I say that. I actually like Alex's character a lot. Um... Yeah. Like... But he does come off as sort of a creep. Some of the time. He sort of has the, a way of being deliberately mis uh, mysterious in a sort of frustrating way. Although, once you know the, all the plot, which, you know, I well, I know it, then he's a pretty interesting character. But it didn't stop them from screwing him up in the next game. Sort of. Hmm. Whoops, wrong button. I'm sure glad I made it down from that cliff. I could have starved up there! <laughs> okay, I don't think I'm gonna get anything for rescuing him, though. Well, may as well go. Next stop, the... What was it? The Ridge Place? In any case, we're going south. East. Southeast. Off we go! Um... Actually, we came here before, didn't we? Because I went the wrong way. Well... Insofar as it is the wrong way, it's not really wrong so much as suboptimal. At least I remember right, because admittedly I could be misremembering, but I'm pretty sure that this area is the one where, uh, or that we can get through this area without the uh, lash. Without the power of lash. Um. So here's how this works. If we step on this once, it cracks. If we step on it again, we fall through. We've sort of, we've seen something similar before. Is all I'll say on the matter. In the first Golden Sun game. Although, how recent was that? Or rather, I'm trying to think. Did we Yeah, we did in the tree. With jumping on the cobwebs. Is this an artifact? It... well, sort of. I think? Does this count as an artifact? It might just be a good armor. Um, anyway, that's plus 14. That's plus... wow. That's plus 16. That is... plus 14 as well. Which makes sense, because they both have better armor than Shiba. I- wait. No, they're totally all wearing the same armor! Why is this so much more for Shiba, then? That's kind of weird. I guess it's because of her- her class must have good defense right now. Hmm. Yeah, that must be it. Okay, well, I'm gonna put this on Felix. Because he is tanky, I guess. We're gonna go with that. Um, yeah. Okie dokie, then. I believe we want to go this way. And we're already at the exit. I lied. We're not already at the exit. So remember how those things, holes fell? Well, guess what? Now these pillars do the same thing. After we kill some angle worms. Uh, yeah. Except, why aren't they dead yet? I feel like that should have killed them. I might be underestimating these a little bit. Just a little. Hmm. 
in this box it is an elixir. Wow, that's that's underwhelming. Okay. You know, actually, let's give the smoke bomb to you. Mmm, okay. I can cross this easily enough. I'm pretty sure there's more of these later on, though. Okay, we cannot actually get past this right now. Maybe that was what I was thinking of? Maybe. Can I? No, it's too far away. It's a skeleton? You look familiar. Can I kill you in a single round? Not quite. I'm guessing four hits, though. Yep. Well, I need to get stronger then. Mmm, do I want to fall down here? I don't think I do. So, oh. Okay, I have to go down then. There's no way. Hmm, I guess I'll try it here? Oh. I should have gone higher up. I should have gone higher up. I need the box! I don't know what's in the box, but I need the box! Actually, actually, is that box a mimic? I don't think it's a mimic, but I kind of feel like it's a mimic. Well, I guess there's one way to find out. Okay, what am I... Oh, I know what I'm missing here. I made a stupid mistake. It is not a mimic, it's a mint! Which increases my agility. Uh, here's the thing though. The ideal character to give this to is not presently in my party. We're gonna be holding on to that uh, for a little bit. Mmm. Let's use this because I feel like it. That is not as effective as I was expecting against the ghost, I've got to be honest. Well, whatevs. We still killed it before it did anything. And at the end of the day, that's what counts. Okay. So, I remembered how to do this. Sort of. I mean, well, Remembered, figured it out, however you want to say it. You see, we can't step on these, but we can jump over a hole in the ground. And that's the solution that I totally forgot. Can't get past this one either. That's annoying. Now... Okay. Is there anything down here? Or is it just the jumping correctly? Okay, well I can go to that part. And then... Oh, I see. So I'm gonna need to, to get the box. I'm going to need to sabotage myself, basically. That's what really... You're fighting me on the freaking pillar? Well, that's just not right. That is just really not right. <laughs> like, how does this happen? What is this? Some sort of sick gladiator match? I gotta tell you, I've already done Colosso, and this is no Colosso. I come to think of it, that sort of thing didn't happen in Colosso, although it would be totally the right way. I have screwed up. Sh son of a bitch. Okay. Take two. Okay, this time, when I go across here, I want to jump to here. So that I can do this. And a game. Because that makes this collapse and gives me access to the box, which is. An axe! My first artifact, what weep on. Unleashes stone justice. So, obviously, only Felix can use this of my current party. Um, also, I want to check while I'm here. Okay, this shaman's rod doesn't actually have an unleash. That explains a lot. It's kind of... I don't know why not. I'm pretty sure I had an Alicia in the first game. Unless I remember wrong. But in any case, it doesn't have one now. And that's the important part. <laughs> Much like it's important that I can three-shot the ghost, but I cannot three-shot the skeleton. Although I don't know if it's actually optimal to kill this. Oh hey, I can do that with my new axe now. 
Awesome. I'm gonna need to reevaluate some things. Anyway, let's actually get through this screen now. Because I, I think third time can be is allowed to be the charm. I've heard that that's a thing. And we're good. Just don't jump down again by accident. Yeah, you see, I knew there was an axe like that around here somewhere. I guess I just got confused of which chest it was in. Man, and my mimic senses are completely off in this as well? That's gonna be a bit of trouble, I think. It's gonna take a while to accommodate. That plus also I'm probably more experienced with the first game, if I had to guess. Uh, oh, there's still more. But we've got to be getting close to the end now. Um, what? Where? Where would I go if I fell down here? I see a cave over there. Okay. Okay. So, if we go straight up, then we come out over here. I see. It's a Jenny. Oh. And it fell down. I'm back here, Jenny. You shall be mine! Um... Next time. Okay, so I'm actually going to stop up here because this is a good opportunity to do so. So join me next time when we chase down that Mars Jenny and force him to join our team. Until then, this has been Let's Play Golden Sun with Chaos Blue. And have a good day. Bye!